the starting was worse firstly it was planned that we will go to the chunambar boat house and from there through backwater we will come to the paradise beach Finally got myself a cycle. This pretty pink cycle, which I'll take, and probably I'll go and visit some of these places in the White Town. And as it is the last evening or afternoon of my trip, so I want to make the most of it. So, ever if you if you can ride scooter or bike. So it is available over any place, but as we can't, so we need to go. So all of you who doesn't or do not know to ride bikes or scooty, they obviously can go for cycles, and these cycles are available for the whole day of at rupees hundred. And I am now going to ride it. Definitely come, and I can see the beautiful lighthouse. But unfortunately, visitors are not allowed. What's that? White town. White town. Your buildings. Mandir, temple. Okay. Ah, uh, also white town and mandir. Temple. Okay. Riding, we didn't leave any street of White Town unseen, unheard, unexplored. We went to every possible street, and you can see the photos. It was amazing. Now I am in Notre Dame Church, which is another church, and it is one of the most 
famous and the oldest church it was built in 1738 and the structure and everything i didn't photograph inside the church because i don't think that is appropriate so right now i'm just sitting outside you can see that is the church so i am sitting you can see all sun tanned but doesn't matter so i am right now sitting outside the church and it has been a wonderful experience here where people are just offering their prayers and there was another temple that we went just before this we saw an elephant and i will be honest but i didn't like it i didn't like the poor elephant probably i don't know kab se khada hoga wahan pe without water without food just entertaining visitors and also the man who was actually you know uh, talking to the elephant he was holding a cane so i didn't like the concept but people were liking it very much people were uh, giving money and he was blessed she was blessing lakshmi was her name so yeah it was it is a kind of mixed feeling mixed opinion i won't pass any judgment or comment here the tourists seem to love it and right now we are just sitting outside notre dame and we we'll take some photos and then we'll go i'll update you i don't know when we'll go but i love it So if you are coming to Pondicherry and you are not visiting the white town or you are not clicking pictures with a colorful building then why are you visiting Pondicherry So basically as this is the last evening of our trip today so me and my brother are just roaming around these lanes of white town and clicking photographs and that is our cute little cycle This one is mine and that one is my brother's <laughs> <laughs> there he is. He just went to see whether there are any buildings or not over that side. exhausted and tired guess what i didn't make note of the time but we actually rode the bicycle through the white town for at least 4 hours straight so after the so hard work we did actually pretty well covered most of the areas so one of the biggest thing that you need in pondicherry is your own vehicle because the one thing that i learned that the auto drivers are chore so all of you whoever is planning to come to pondicherry if you can ride a bike then well and good if you can't then rent a bicycle for a day which will cost you 100 rupees and you can cover all the places within one or two days and it will save a lot of money so listen one always carry your id cards because you never know the bicycle stands generally keep your id card as a form of safety so i am going to sleep right now because i am so exhausted and so much fun we had today hey guys this is me arbita so this is almost now it is 9:15 and we are heading towards some cafe where we will grab our breakfast then come back to the hotel and take our luggage and head back to chennai yeah finally i hate this part but the trip is going to end
Shahbaz was to have breakfast at Cafe Des Arts, but uh, yes, as it is Sunday and it is very crowded, so we couldn't get a place. And the waiting hour in more or less every hotel and restaurant in Pondicherry is about 40 to 45 minutes, so we don't have time today. But uh, that is why we went to this cafe called Koromandal Restaurant or cafe, and we ordered. Uh, bread omelette, Benedict, bacon Benedict, and what is it? Cappuccino and filter coffee. Yeah, the price of the toast and omelette was 30 rupees. And, and there were only two pieces. Only two pieces of, uh, one piece of omelette and two pieces of bread that to cut in half. What? Price to quantity ratio was very bad. Definitely not worth having. You can try the Benedict. It's a one-time try. It's not bad. It's not very really good. So, as he told, it was not that worth it. I am not at all full. I can have a one plate biryani easily right now. But uh, we are keeping it light. So, but from the perspective of breakfast, also this was uh, the amount was exorbitant. It was very 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 high and definitely not worth it yes if you want to try the benedict that is their special that is their signature then obviously do that that's 350 rupees for two pieces my hand size my palm size that's it it was okay it was very lavish and the quantity was this much we finally came last time to this beach rock beach to say goodbye because our trip has officially ended and we will be heading towards Chennai in few hours doing the packing and everything so hate to say this but finally I have to go home the vacation is over so guys let me know if you like this whole Pondicherry series and any other recommendations and anything please let me know and also like and subscribe to this channel because much happening and more other things are coming so you don't want to miss that so pondicherry you are beautiful thank you for your warm welcome